So it's uh, end of the second week of June and it uh, feels like uh, April actually. A little cold, windy, still getting lots of rain, although it seems to have eased off a little bit. So it's time to go on another of my jaunts and uh, this time it's not going to be quite as ambitious as, it has to be said as the uh, the Ireland and the Scotland run. Well, the little YB isn't coming on this run, perhaps unfortunately, but uh, I don't think it's ready for it. And uh, the others would be held back by me. Well, we're off to Normandy, two weeks uh, after the, um, the main celebration because I didn't particularly want to get embroiled in that. But six of us are going. Um, two of us are leaving tomorrow, Saturday. And we're going to head down to Poole and stay the night there, getting the ferry at 8.30 on Sunday morning. The other two are bravely going to come down on Sunday morning by getting up at stupid o'clock and riding down and uh, hopefully getting to the, uh, the ferry on time. We have six days in France where we're planning to go around the main historic World War II beaches and um, various areas in Normandy. And we're staying in a hotel in Bayeux. Um, so we'll be going off on day trips from there. So in terms of distance, although we're going to France, the longest ride is actually from here to Poole Harbour, where we get the ferry. I'm just hoping, it's a bit breezy out there today, I'm just hoping it's not going to be too breezy on the English Channel on Sunday morning. Otherwise we'll all be green when we get to, to uh, Normandy. Anyway, I'm taking the little uh, XSR125, which um, I plan at one stage or another to festoon with uh, camera equipment. So hopefully some of the footage will be worth uh, publishing when I get back. All that's needed, the plastic bags so that it doesn't get wet. Right. But I really am not taking that much. Oh, my dad. No, so you won't need a t-shirt the first night you get there at all. I never wear joggers or a sweatshirt after the uh, 1st of May. Today is the 14th of June. It's bloody horrible weather. Cold, rainy, windy, unbelievable. Two years ago, I was on the YB in Ireland in the peeing rain. This time last year, I was in Scotland when it was unexpectedly boiling hot and I went around Scotland on the YB. And this year we've chosen to do something slightly different. Tomorrow, six of us are off to Normandy. And uh, I'm not gonna be on the YB. To be honest, I could do it. It seems to be going okay again now, but uh, I wouldn't be able to keep up with the others, so um, um, I'm taking the XSR 125, which is a lovely little bike. Just wanted to do it on something small. Uh, fat man, tiny bike syndrome. And um, the weather is looking decidedly mixed, and that's in an optimistic way. I'm going to be in France uh, five and a half days, effectively. So, tomorrow afternoon, um, we're going to try and dodge the rain on the way to Poole. Four of us are staying the night in Poole overnight and the other two are joining us from Bristol um, on Sunday morning. And uh, we've got about a three and a half hour, four hour crossing to Normandy, to Cherbourg from Poole. And then we've got the afternoon on um, Sunday. So we're going to head down the um, Cherbourg Peninsula down to Utah Beach and then into Carentan, and then uh, back to our hotel in Bayer. We're basically gonna be doing day, day trips from Bayer every day, 
Bayer is just um, 15 miles or so south of the south of the coastline. So we're going to be fanning out in different directions, going and visiting various historic sites, um, some the inevitable museums. Really hoping to go to the uh, Caen Memorial Museum, um, which is one of the best. Uh, museums of warfare awful to talk, say warfare but i mean it is a stunning museum absolutely amazing um and hopefully we're going to make it to hill 112 where jeff's father-in-law lorraine's father um served in 1944 uh, so hopefully we'll make it to there as well the weather is looking decidedly dodgy Every day it seems to be cha changing. Tuesday looks appalling, so we'll have to have a good look at that. Somebody's just stopped and said, do I need any help? <laughs> I must look in a bad way. Um, no, I was gonna say, uh, I'm not gonna be posting anything on YouTube about this until I can edit it all properly. So it could be a month or so before uh, the story gets onto YouTube. Um, but I want to make sure I do a decent job in, in editing it. Uh, so uh, um, I've got some other stuff I can put up in the meantime. So we'll just have to um, be patient on that. And uh, hopefully uh, I'll get some decent footage while I'm over there. Anyway, with that, the promised rain has started. Just take a look at this for a pothole. The country is littered with these. Great for cyclists and motorcyclists. Anyway, the promised rain is just about to start. So I'm gonna get home, finish me packing, and uh, go and see the osteopath this afternoon. Yes, the back has chosen a good time to uh, fail on me. Well here's the bike all loaded up. I was going to take it out but guess what it's just started raining while I've been on the phone to Jeff. Anyway these bags I'll go out and check them in the morning if I need to or later on today. Um, look pretty good I'm not carrying very much with me to be honest I've learned over these last couple of years that I'm carrying stuff I don't need anyway there it is